comfortability together or looking at the games up to this point, having 10 games in and being at five and five, just what you can say about the comfortability of the team at this point. Um, I think that we're starting to get the hang of it. I think we're, uh, I think um, those early losses um, helped us come together a lot more in the locker room. <clears throat> we've had a couple of uh, times where we've sat down and we talked as a team and it's like, you know, like now is the time. Like, we can't keep waiting. We can't keep saying this after a loss. Like it's time to go. Like these wins don't come easy and these losses come fast if you if you just, you know, messing around. So I think uh, as a group, we just decided that enough was enough and it's time to just start getting the ball rolling. Um, listen to our game plan, um, follow the direction of the coaches and just go out there and play hard. Xavier, your thoughts? Um, yeah, just going off of what Zai said, you know, also having, you know, the main core from last year, having all some new players, you know, the first few games might have been a little gel, you know, we might not know how to play with each other, but learning how to play with each other, learning how to, you know, come back from losses, that was, that was a big help for the team. What is it about this team 10 games in that you guys have fun with? Like, what's, what's exciting about it, either in practice or just off the court itself, away from the game? How does this team gel personality-wise? Um, I think the most fun part about it is knowing that we're not at our best yet and we're still playing how we're playing, you know, especially the last two games. We see what we can be and we still know that we still have stuff that we can work on. I think we all just uh, have, like, a, a big passion for basketball. That brings us together more than anything. Um, I think we come in, we ready to work. We want to get better. We want to just be the best Lemoyne. I think we come into the to the gym every day with a mindset of being the best Lemoyne team to touch, to touch the floor, to be here in Syracuse. So I think that drives us every day, um, just our passion overall for the game. When you have a four and one start in the NE10, you heard your coach talk about it and how quickly things can change in the conference. I want to start with you and Xavier, get your thoughts about this conference itself and about how strong you've started in the first five games. Um, I think it's really important that we did that. And I think it's, uh, Gonna set us up for a lot of success in the future. Um, I think we can continue to build off of it. It just gives us a lot. Of, you know, we try not to be. Um, we talk about all the time being a feel-good team, but I think it's good to have success and see success, so we know what it feels like to win and we know what it feels like to lose. So um, I think just continuing to build on that, um, we should be perfectly fine. Just continue to follow the directions of the coaches and listen to our game plan, and we can execute on that. Well, to go off of that, I feel well, basically what he said, and then. You know, losing the first few games of the season, being able to start off how we started in the conference, I feel like that's big for us, seeing that, you know, we can lose games and tomorrow's a new day. So we can't dwell on what we did in the past. We just have to be better the next day. Final note, Xavier, you heard Zai talk about you guys kept saying we got to stop it. We got to get to this point here. We got to turn that corner and you can't just keep saying it. What happened with the team that you finally were able to do what you said you were going to do? Um... I don't know if it was an exact moment, but every day coming into practice, working hard, and then coming into the games, feeling free, feeling that the games are easier than practice. I feel like that's the main thing that we can do that helps us to be successful in the game. Thank you guys, appreciate it. Hey, Dad, you win.